I am Asha Molak from Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. My name is Charles Sanchez. I'm coming at you from New York City. I live in Winston-Salem, North Carolina, the Bible Belt of the South, where HIV, um, if we don't talk about it, it doesn't exist. Well, we know that that is quite incorrect. Hola, mi nombre es Ariana Lynn. Soy una mujer transgénero. I am 65 years old, soon to be 66, and I have been living with HIV for 15 years and have had an undetectable viral load for the past 14 years. My name is Linus Ignatius and I've been undetectable for the last two years. Yo soy una persona positiva que vive con el VIH y que tiene niveles indetectables. I started treatment and within 30 days my viral load became undetectable. I've been living with AIDS since 2008, undetectable since uh, within about three months of my hospitalization. I'm here today to share with you what it means for me to live with an undetectable viral load. Being undetectable or virally suppressed for me means that I can wake up every day knowing that everything is going to be just fine. A lot of the language around HIV transmission rates is murky and is designed to make people more afraid. A lot of people are using antiquated information to talk about HIV. I was scared to have sex felt dirty inside. I've always had partners who do not have HIV, so one of my biggest fears and worries as somebody living with HIV is that I could possibly pass on HIV to my partner. The partner study has been following over a thousand couples in which one person is HIV positive but undetectable and the other person is HIV negative. In 58,000 sex acts without condoms, not a single case of transmission has been documented. There hasn't been a single case to date. As a former registered nurse and as a person living with this virus, that undetectable means uninfectious. If there is no virus cir circulating in your blood, then you can't pass it on. Having this science is, is critical. Uh, there's still so much stigma and so much misinformation out there. The research is excellent here, showing that this is a highly effective HIV prevention measure. We went straight to the world's experts to get their opinions. The heads of the major studies, including Partner, as well as the New York City Department of Health, have issued statements supporting the idea that in the case of an undetectable viral load, the risk of transmission is negligible. The CDC puts negligible on the same level as spitting and biting and throwing bodily fluids. Quote, it's so low it's not worth considering. Insignificant. With successful antiretroviral treatment, that individual is no longer infectious. All this time that I've been undetectable most of my HIV life. No one has gotten sick from me. And that's really powerful that, that you can't get HIV from someone who's undetectable. And I think everybody needs to know that we need to shout this from the rooftops. Que el ser indetectable es ser una persona saludable y no transmitible. Ser indetectable significa la mejor arma de prevención. It also means that you may have to educate your physicians. As we saw at the dawn of the HIV epidemic, it can take years for the Center of Disease Control to adapt to the most relevant and newest information. My wife's doctor, because she's HIV negative and goes to, doesn't go to an HIV practitioner, was getting very different information than what I was getting from my practitioner. I had to bring the research to my wife's doctor and show her that this is, you know, this this was no longer an issue. Go to the doctor and we're like, we want to try to have a child. What do we need to do? And she said, we had the green light to go for it. We were both undetectable. We're both active in our treatment. But if you're not actively trying to conceive, you can't have condom sex. But so now we have this confusing information. My practitioner was also kind of like, well, I don't want to share this with everybody because, you know, you sort of fit in this category of, you know, you're. You're HIV positive. You're you're in good health. You're 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 compliant in your treatment. Um, you because you're a pastor. You are are, are not um, promiscuous. Because I fit in all those categories, that I'm safe to know this information, quote unquote, that I was not going to infect her and we can stop using condoms. He didn't want to share that with everybody. Muchas de las personas no saben su estatus o muchas de las personas no tienen un tratamiento correcto. El educar a esas personas y hacer que esas personas sean indetectables a tiempo, eso yo lo llamo salud pública. We are getting married. We are enjoying intimate, loving relationships. It has given my HIV negative girlfriend and I a realistic chance to conceive children naturally. I gave birth to an HIV negative son. I cannot transmit the virus as long as I'm on my medication. And I'm not stupid enough to get off of my medication. 
We know being undetectable doesn't prevent other STIs and pregnancy. Do I use condoms? Yeah, I actually do use condoms. We're not talking about just, you know, go out and be crazy, you know, but at the same time, I think people need to need responsible information. Someone who's undetectable is not a threat. You are not a danger to anyone. I am not a danger to my sexual partner. I can live. You can live. That has become my new normal. That's how we're going to stop this thing called HIV. Thank you.